Bhagavad Gita, Text 2.54 Arjuna asked, What, O Keshava, are the characteristics of one who is accomplished in meditation and steady in intelligence? How does such a steady person speak? How does he sit? How does he move? In asking Krishna how the realized soul speaks, Prabhasheta, Arjuna wants to know how he reacts to others. Sitting, Asita, implies how the realized soul withdraws from worldliness, while his movement, Brajeta, involves the manner in which he interacts with the world. As Krishna answers Arjuna's first question concerning the symptoms of a self-realized soul, he speaks in general about the nature of those aloof from worldly responsibilities. The pure-hearted devotees he alluded to earlier in verse 51. Such persons of inner attainment experience the fruit of the yoga of action in devotion to God. Outwardly, however, Krishna speaks of realization of Brahman. That aspect of himself attained by karma yogis who have awakened self-knowledge. The section of the Gita, beginning with the next verse, continues to the end of this chapter. In this important division of the text, Krishna describes the ideal person he ultimately wants Arjuna to become. He will elaborate on this section throughout the next four chapters, unpacking all that is contained herein.